I watched Powell's speech and it was really amazing. This is very similar and eerily reminiscent of the end of 2018 and beginning of 2019. Billionaire Chamafali Hapilia says, mock it off to the race. As fake capitulate, let's take a look at his outlook. Chamaf says that the market are likely to witness more boosts to the upside, following the recent comment of the Fed chairman Jerome Perel. In a new All in a Podcast episode, the venture capitalists say that the statement made by Chairman Perel during the Federal Open Market Committee meeting last week indicated that the Federal Reserve is beginning to ease the pace of future rate hike. In December, he was extremely hawkish. And he was basically like, listen, we're going to keep rates higher than you like and longer than you want. And that was pretty clear, and the markets reacted. And then not but 35, 40 days later, he essentially said, we have two 25 basis point hikes left to go. And he's going to try to stick the landing, essentially. And even though the rest of the language in his entire speech and the press conference if you read it in the absence of his body language, so if you just read the transcript, it would seem very hawkish as well. But the reality was he basically capitulated. And then the market essentially said, okay, we're at the end of this thing. And we've talked about this before, but markets tend to bottom six to nine months before it's clear that you could have done this. And so we're a little bit off to the races in the short term. According to Chamath, the market could mirror its late 2018 to early 2019 price action, a period when the market included Bitcoin and crypto skyrocket. At the end of 2018, October, November, December, the markets just fell. And part of it was Powell's going to raise rates, inflation's getting out of control, etc., etc. And then we got all this data that said China may be entering a real period of malaise, and Powell capitulated, again, trying to stick the landing. And long story short, he didn't. That was a head fake, and the markets just ripped higher. I think we're about to replay a little bit of that. At least in the next 30 to 90 days, the pain trade is to go up. 